Mufukeng, Willem Boshoff, Jackson Lungwane, Maggie Lopesha, Credo Mudwa, Nuria Mabaso, J.H. Pionief and Helen Sibidi. Well, that's the UJ Art Gallery's latest exhibition titled Shifting Conversations, with, which opened on a Wednesday and will run until the 22nd of November. It's curated by seasoned art writers and curators Melissa Gorba as well as Johan Mayberg, who join us now to tell us more about the exhibition. A very good morning to you guys and welcome to Morning Lab. Thank you. Thank you. Johan, quickly give us a background into what Shifting Conversations is and what inspired it. Right. We were um, invited by the MTN Foundation and uh, the UJ um, University of Johannesburg Gallery to put together an exhibition from the two existing permanent collections of these two institutions. The idea we wanted to convey was to work with these, uh, the work collected over many years and to create a conversation um, about where we are and how do we deal with artwork um, to our disposal. Do we take it off? Do we hide it? Do we, do we want it to enter a new conversation? And that, hence the, the title of the show. I was about to ask you, Melissa, the significance behind the title, but since uh, Johan has put it out there for us, what type of conversations do you think need to be had uh, in relation to art, in relation to uh, the display of art, in relation to uh, how artists are uh, allowed to express themselves in the country? Look, I think um, the important thing to acknowledge is that um, the production of art has been happening amidst everything historically that has taken place. So... UJ is made up, for example, of three uh, different institutions that actually came together, together. And those institutions had been collecting art for a time immemorial, I would say. Um, versus then the MTN uh, art collection, which um, Johannes just mentioned, which started collecting probably in about 1996, thereabouts. So the... Um, and also just bearing in mind the different mandates that these collections have. So MTN, for example, is a communications company. Therefore, a lot of their, their work, albeit uh, visual and that, would need to at least speak to their, their particular mandate or their, the area of business. And UJ had a little bit more of a, a sort of a loose, if you will, um, sort of... Uh, uh, impetus to, to, to collect art. So the conversations shifting then are looking at how these different institutions, MTN and UJ, have been collecting art from the beginning of uh, the inception of the institutions until now and what that actually reflects in terms of what, what the collections have in them. And so what type of conversations do you hope will be sparked by the artworks? Look, I think um, what we've, we, we went through a period, Johanna and I went through a period where um, we, when, when selecting the art, there were certain um, dynamics that, that came through. So looking at the issue of land, for example, um, the, the 1913 Land Act, how is that reflected in the collection or how they, the, the, these different institutions have been collecting? You have a PNF. Um, for example, who was a sort of the, the poster boy, if you will, of um, the apartheid era, the, uh, the, the poster artist of the apartheid era, and versus uh, 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 Nguna landscape, which was made in a, a much more recent time. Mm -hmm. And all of these different landscapes speak to that, the difference of subjectivity, of perspective, um, considering whether or not we actually are in a position to um, feel that we, we, we now own the land that we have been fighting for. All right. And, and uh, a lot of those kinds of things are, are what interests, interested us. All right, Johan, speak to us about the other artists that uh, are a part of this exhibition. What kind of dynamic or, or what are the sort of uh, special elements that they have brought into this exhibition, in your opinion? Well, the most wonderful thing, I think, at first is, is to be able to work with these, to see these works up close. Um, they're hanging normally in, in offices and, and corridors where, where the public, they don't have access to these works. So all of a sudden, you, you can come up close to a, to a most beautiful Duran Chihlale mm. or, um, or Christo Kutsia, mm. and, uh, and you can closely inspect the work. Um, the conversations, I think it's, um, 
Well, to my mind, uh, when, when the lights go off in the gallery, I think there's a lovely conversa conversation between <laughs> those artists um, never had the opportunity to talk to one another. And hopefully um, the, the viewer would, would enter the gallery and, and, and pick up something of that. You see, it's all about context. I think you can, you can, the work doesn't change, but the way you arrange works, mm. um, that, 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 and you the way you may view context. the work as well yeah. may change over time. Yeah. I think so. Yes, I think so. I and think the, that's the, the, the idea. important thing, and I think what, just to extend on what uh, Johanna is saying, that shift is the, the, the main sort of focus of the, the conversation. Because yes. as you know, conversations have been taking place um, all of this time, whether it's in, in the privacy of our own homes or in a public um, platform. But what this exhibition allows for is to at least look at the, the progression that shift in the dynamics that have influenced the way that conversations are taking place. Well, Johan and Melissa, thank you so much for coming through to the You're show welcome. and speaking to us. Really enjoyed that talk. Thank you. That's uh, Johan and Melissa, who are the co-curators of the UJ Art Gallery's latest exhibition titled Shifting Conversations. And you've heard how they've eloquently explained that to us. It will run until the 22nd of November. The exhibition consists of over 40 artworks, including paintings, sculptures, drawings, photographers and installations. All right, time for us uh, to take a quick coffee break and we'll be back after this.